have Adam Larkin from Git. Good morning, Adam. Welcome good morning. back. Thanks, man. Always great to be here. Always good to have you. Now, you've been all over the place, globe trotting lately with Git. Uh, how's it been? It's going great, man. We're in 41 states. Uh, just keep networking. Just did a podcast in California. Um, things are going awesome. Yeah. On TV, radio, podcast, you're everywhere. Yeah, we definitely try and promote hard. I think I've got a star in the studio with me. But uh, you have a big event coming up tomorrow at uh, North Laurel High School football field, the second annual Get Recovery Celebration. Tell us about it. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. So I do this event in London. London's where I got sober myself about four and a half years ago. So I just want to do something to give back to the community. Also showcase all those people that are in recovery actually out there doing something. Um, there's a lantern lighting ceremony so people can light lanterns off to celebrate their sobriety and clean dates. And also, if somebody's lost somebody in substance abuse or alcoholism, so they can do that in remembrance of them. Or if they're just, if you're in the community, you got a family, you want to come hang out, there's going to be a ton of free food, games, uh, live music. It'll be, it'll be a great event for everybody. It's free. Everybody's welcome. Like you said, everybody's welcome and it's for everybody. Uh, we have all been touched somehow or other with addiction. There's somebody, maybe ourselves or somebody in our family that's been a victim of it. Yeah, and that's why so I do it's it. everybody. Absolutely, that's why I do it during Recovery Month in September because it's uh, every family, every person, every community is affected by it, and that's Recovery Month's theme. Okay, you're going to have live music. Eldon Huff's going to be there. Eldon Huff will be there, man. I can't wait to hear him. Great guy, great, uh, great artist, and uh, and of course you have food trucks and the lantern. Uh, Release is going to be held again this year. Yep, right at, right at nightfall. Yeah. And uh, so I'm also the director of community outreach for New Hope Council and Recovery. They're a big sponsor. They'll be there. Um, there'll be a ton of treatment centers and sober livings and everybody else um, that has basically anything to do with this field will be there within a few hundred mile radius. There'll be a ton of resources for people. And really, it's just to remember, you know, at one point I was struggling, you know what I mean? Uh, I need to look back and sometimes we get so focused like you're saying like well trotting or you know have a career and doing something but it's like in remembrance of why I'm doing this to give back to the community to show other people there's hope and that's why I started get apparel you know to motivate and inspire people that no matter what happened in your life you know the future's the future the past the past you can't change but you can definitely take steps and do something different so you have a great future well you certainly are a testament to the fact that you can get sober and you can get on the right track and and do something for yourself and your family. Absolutely. That's why we go so hard with the motivation and inspiration. Yeah. All right. So uh, how can folks find out more information about uh, Get Recovery and even Get Apparel? Yeah. So that's, that's a cool thing. Absolutely. Um, so Get Apparel, G-I-T-T-L-I-V-E dot com is the website. Um, New Hope Council on Recovery, N-H-C-R, letter four or number four letter U dot com is the website, 606-594-7479 for New Hope, and then 859-803-2864 for Git. And also, um, Git and Adam Larkin on Facebook, G-I-T-T -T underscore apparel for Instagram and TikTok, and then Git Apparel is the YouTube channel. Lots of ways to uh, get in touch with you and keep up with what's going on. Absolutely. Anything else before we move on? Come out. It's going to be a great event. Free food. It'll be... It'll be fantastic. Everybody's welcome. All right. It's hard to believe this is only the second event. Yeah, and the mayor made it an official day. The yes. second September. Tell us about that. There's a proclamation. The second uh, Saturday in September is Get Recovery Day. Yeah. So that's awesome. That is awesome. Very, very nice. I saw that on uh, on Facebook recently. Very good. All right. Well, Adam, Adam Larkin of Get and uh, Get Recovery, Get Apparel. Uh, be sure and check him out on all the social media websites and uh, keep up what's going on. Exciting stuff. Appreciate you, brother. Thanks for having me. All right. See you tomorrow night. Yes, sir. Coming up, we have the birthday club. We'll find out who's getting older out there. Brought to you by Dino's. Right now, it's Adam, not Adam Larkin, but Alan Watts with today's Traveling Bluegrass. Brought to you by Southern States. Let him go. And now I gotta buy your food. Buy your Yesterday dinner. I said Adam Larkin or Adam Lambert's gonna be on with me tomorrow. <laughs> Not Adam Lambert, Adam Larkin. I'm like, I, I owe you for the extra plug. Nah, no problem. Yeah, I appreciate you, man. Yeah. Like I said, it would be cool to do something like this. I'm like, I love this. Yeah.
I'm not even close to knowing what I'm doing like you do. My deal is video stuff, not audio, but yeah. it'd be fun just to have time every day just to go to radio stations and chop it up with the DJ. Well, and, and you know, it's, it's getting to be more video oriented for us as well. We do a lot of Facebook Live and stuff. And right. That's a component of all the live broadcasts. Right. Is, uh, is Alyssa going to be there doing anything with you then? I don't know. Alyssa has left us. Oh, really? She's struck out on her own. Oh, her right. own digital marketing huh. business. So. Does she know what she's doing? I knew this was going to come. I thought she's won all these awards. And I said, she's going to leave this man. She's not going to stay in here with us. So I'll let her back. Who, uh, who took her place? Nobody yet. I think uh, Mike Carr has somebody. Uh, I think I have the impression that there's somebody waiting in the wings. We'll find out soon enough. Okay. But, yeah. but I, I hate change. Right. I'm, I'm a creature of habit. I get used to people and things. And, uh, well, so would technically, I mean, I know obviously you're on boss, you do your own thing, but would technically somebody be over you? Whoever takes her spot? Yeah. It, yeah, they yeah, they're the boss, the general manager of the state. So, yeah, I'm calling under them, me and Terry. Well, hopefully they're cool. Yeah, hopefully so. Yeah. That is true. But this guy, you know, it's a strange business, really. Yeah. Daniel comes in red. Farmall. You can't, you can't have too many constraints. Right. It's kind of a loose, loose. Yeah, because if you do it, the radio station ain't going to be legit. Like, right. Nobody wants to hear all that constraints. You'll be able to do your own thing. What time you have, What time you got to do this stuff every morning? Like usually nine o'clock. Oh, okay, nine. And then I go in there and work on news and that sort of thing. Nice and exciting. I keep the, uh, the news up to date on our website. And kind of coordinate sports from the budget. Yeah, I'm excited about the event, but I'll also be excited myself. <laughs> I know what you mean. Yeah. Well, I appreciate you, bud. Yes, sir. Appreciate you. You guys are always awesome and supportive. Well, I, we're glad to do it. It's a, it's a great thing.